out for Roland and Richard! festival to oh, get yeah. us started. Uh, you, sir, I don't know you. What's your first name? Max. Max, I start with an M? Nailed it, great. Can <laughs> I get any word that starts with the letter M, please? Machine. Monopoly. Whoa, whoa, I, I heard a lot of things. I heard machine clearly, I think. Machine, right? Great, thank you, machine. Appreciate it. Well, I think I can fix it. I hope so. Well. It's my only source of joy. Oh. <laughs> I explained why well, I don't have a lot of stuff in here. I, I don't, don't need anything no, I, I but that yeah. to be working. Well, I'll be honest, I've never seen anything like it, but I mean, I, I've been around machines my whole life, you know? Mm -hmm. Ever since I was a little boy, I was around a car, a lawnmower, I mean, all sorts of machines. <laughs> All right, son, this is a lawnmower. Oh. It's also a machine. Wow. <laughs> I mean, that's all I need to know. <laughs> that's it. And I figured my destiny has been set. My dad bought me a set of tools, and I still keep, let me show you this. Oh. Let me show you this. I still keep the little wrench that he gave me. Look at that. Go ahead and press it. Squeak. Yeah, it squeaked. <laughs> yeah. Didn't do much, though. But That's yeah. delightful. Well, thank you, thank you. I wouldn't have called you if I didn't have the utmost confidence in your ability. Well, that's what it says on my flyer. I have the utmost confidence in my ability. That paid by the sentence. All right, uh, so let me just get this right. Yeah, you it's want just one just sentence. I have the utmost confidence in, in my, my ability. ability. Yeah, and then my phone number in the bottom. Okay. That's it. Great, I'll print 100. All right, thank you. <laughs> and here we are. Here we are. Here we are. Yeah, I've never seen anything like this. It's a dehumidifier. Get out! <laughs> get out! I've never seen one of these. I can't get out. If I breathe the air outside, I'll die. <laughs> I need it to be dehumidified. I understand, I understand. I have about an hour before I'll get the shakes. <laughs> I'll tell you what, I love your attitude. You're all smiles and... Right <laughs> now I am! <laughs> can you fix it in an hour? Uh, yeah, hey, if I had another flyer, it would say I can fix anything under an hour. Hey, I can make you a second no, flyer. No, I'm good, man, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I don't, but trust me, I can fix this oh, dehumidifier under an hour. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Tell me something, how come you don't have anything else in here other than this? I'm allergic to most things. Get out of here. I can't. What? <laughs> I live firmly in this house. Well, that is amazing. Mm -hmm. That is amazing. I mean, I don't, I mean, you'll have nowhere to sit. You have no table. Mm -mm. You have, I don't even see a kitchen. Who needs one of those? Huh? They're full of food. I'm allergic to most food. Riz, <laughs> get out. No. <laughs> <laughs> Must be hard. I can't imagine not being able to leave my house. Oh, it's fine after a while. You get used to it. I've named all the walls. Get out. <laughs> all six of them? Mm-hmm. I'm counting the floor and the ceiling. I understood. OK. <laughs> You're walking on Suzanne. I'm sorry, Suzanne. <laughs> no, that's, she likes being walked on. She's a floor. <laughs> I used to date a Suzanne. She did not like being walked on. Sweetheart, uh, my back hurts. Uh, you sure you want me to do this? I, I we yeah. try it. All right. <laughs> Let me know if you're OK with this. Yeah, I think I'll be fine with it. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely hated being walked on. <laughs> mm. All right, put away the wrench. I don't think I need it, but this screwdriver, I think you got a loose thing here, loose thingy. It's a technical term. <laughs> I don't know your world. I trust you. I don't think you know the world. You're in here all the whole time. Touche. Thank you. <laughs> you remind me of Herbert. <laughs> Who's Herbert? This one. Oh, uh, the wall. This wall. What? Not to be confused with Charlie. Now, I... 
Excuse me, I just a layman, and I, I never named my walls, but Charlie and Herbert. You should try. It. I'll tell you what. When I go home, maybe I'll give it a shot. Mm. It'll upset the wife. She doesn't like me naming things. <laughs> so I. Oh, uh, let's call him. Don't you dare! <laughs> Do not name him. Oh, uh, the child is not going to sleep. Go to sleep, child. Go to, can we please? Child sounds like a name. Stop using it. Stop it. Okay, you. Just go on. Just go to school, you. Go, you. I don't know what you're calling. Go, you. Go. Name nothing. So I won't do it in front of her. Look, I, I got to be honest. I don't see a difference between Charlie and Herbert. What makes me remind you of Herbert? You're so sturdy. I have so much confidence in you. Herbert holds up the ceiling like no other wall. Well, I mean, no offense, guy, but Charlie holding up the ceiling also. Charlie is doing okay. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot believe after all these years he's still upset over a crack. You know what he's like. I know, but I never hear the end of it. Herbert's the funny one. Herbert's the one he loves. I can hear you. Oh, I know you can hear me, Herbert. And I don't care, because I'm the favorite. One of these days, one of these days, Herbert, I hope you get mold. Do you hear me? I hope you get mold, Herbert. I hope Would you, you two shut up down oh, there? Come on. You're with the attitude constantly above us like you're lording over I us. am literally better than you because I'm higher off the ground. Without you. me, you'd fall on top of Susan. Think about that. Do not bring me into this. Keep talking about me. I'm the great one. Susan, shut up. People walk on you. I want people to walk on me. It's my job and I do a damn good job. Hey, Susan! Jerry? I gotta be honest, there's a part of me that wishes one of the walls would fall so I could end up on top of you. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Jerry? What? I might be into that. <laughs> Don't tempt me, baby. I, it's not yours to decide. Huh? <laughs> Sturdy. Oh, he's he's the best one. Not sturdy. Mm. All right. <laughs> Don't get me started on these two. Okay. Yeah, no, I won't do that. Look, we're running out of time. I got to get this decommitting. Yes, I'm face. going to die any minute. And now. I don't want that on my conscience. <laughs> Let me ask you something. Mm. When was the last time you actually went out those doors and into the world? Well, I was in a bubble. Really? Yes. For how long? Fourteen years. Off my test bubble boy. Listen, I, it's, what? I, I can't, I can't get back into my chair. My bubble won't fit. Well, I don't know what you want. To, my bubble won't I don't fit. Want to get, I can't put you in there. Fuck all of you! I need a house of my own. <laughs> well, that sucks, man. You know, maybe you should. It's a bad memory. I didn't realize it. I haven't relived it in a while. <laughs> Hold me, Herbert. <laughs> oh, you make everything better. Oh, yeah. He said Herbert. Mm. He didn't say hold me, Jerry. He didn't say hold me, Susan. I didn't want to hold him anyway. I'm holding his feet. Always. <laughs> How about that, Herbert? Not the same thing, and you know it. Hey, does anyone remember me? I'm the door. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, door! Shut up! <laughs> Sucks being a door. Oh, he never even goes out of me. <laughs> Please tell me you're fixing it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. <laughs> you know, uh -huh. I don't want to tell you your business or how to live. And I don't want to tell you how to die either, because it ain't going to happen today. But you should walk out that door one day and experience the world. All right, you've inspired me. <laughs> that was it? It's all it took? <laughs> well, you've been here for an hour now. 
Almost. Not a full hour. Not yet. Okay, how much time I got left? 81 seconds. All right, hang on. <laughs> also known as a minute 21. Uh, <laughs> you know what the problem is? You're not plugged in. Son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to ask you. That's, all, that's what it says on the in the front. I don't know where you're actually headed. Oh, we're heading downtown. That's where I want to go. All right, then. Thanks. 31 is the most fun. That's my little song. It's a nice song. <laughs> yeah, one day maybe I'll write a verse or two. That's it? That's all, he, that's all it has? Yeah, really just a title. Ah. Yeah, I just moved here. My, my name's Garrison. Hey, Garrison, how you doing? Welcome to the 31 bus. Yeah, thanks. Boy, did you pick the right bus for your, is your first bus it's, here? This is my first bus Oh, here. boy, oh, boy. Yeah, this is, this is a fun bus. You want a party hat? <laughs> I'm wondering why I had a whole stack of those. Oh, no, they're for you. Is it for anyone else who wants to party? Oh, that's great. Uh, you mind if I grab one of those noisemakers? Do I mind? Well, I don't want to cross the yellow line. You know what? That yellow line is not who can and who can't go where. That line is who wants to party and who doesn't. I want to party. You want to party? Yeah, Cross yeah. that line. <laughs> yeah. This is great. I, you know, when I moved here, I, I, I moved here because I lost my job. And my brother-in-law said he could get me a job here. So I'm crashing at his place right now, which I'll tell you is not fun. Not like being on this bus. You want to live on the bus? <laughs> <laughs> You're not the first to ask. Yeah, is that true? And yeah. you won't be the last. <laughs> Everyone has so much fun on this bus, say, can I live here? Maybe. I'm gonna grab one of those beers. That Cross right? that line, let's party more. Nice. Great. Hell, I'll grab a beer too, it's a special day. Why well, makes it today special, dear? <laughs> Whoa, all right. Yeah, wow. Well, this isn't a long drive. You tell me how to live, you can take that bottle and shove it up your ass! <laughs> that guy does not know how to party. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah, uh, this is great. I mean, you, you're throwing, uh, you're throwing, you're drinking a lot though, and you're throwing bottles out the window. Party bus! Yeah. <laughs> Who are you gonna have the most fun with? Bus driver that just drives? What a loser! <laughs> I noticed some white powder now, which I thought might have been talc on the way up. And oh, it ain't talc! Yeah. <laughs> so I'm gonna, I'm gonna get off. Oh, too much party for one day, huh? Yeah. Hey, you come back anytime you want to party. All right. Party's over for this guy, not for this bus that keeps on going. I'm gonna, I'm gonna walk. So, take care. All right, yeah, for the one there. <laughs> Welcome to the 30 Ready? Hey! hey! I didn't realize my shift was over already. Hey, man. Yeah. Want a beer? I already had six. <laughs> and yes, I do. Hey. <laughs> Sorry! <laughs> so listen. Some new stuff's actually coming into the neighborhood. What new stuff? Yeah. You, you'll be okay with needles, right? <laughs> Whatever you want. Hey. Take one. Right in the heart? Sure. <laughs> That's where you feel the adrenaline most. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Wow. You okay? You okay? Are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay? No, no, I'm fine. This whole thing just came down. I know. That's crazy. No, no, I know it came wow. down. Wow. And we, how are we alive? Well, it came down around us. 
Apparently. Look, are you okay? I don't, I think so. I mean... Because I'm, I'm fine. I guess. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. We lived. Yeah. Cool. All that stuff's trash. Yep. But we lived. Yeah. Uh, this may be weird. One thing that's in that pile of rubble over there is a suicide note. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? Never mind. No, 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 no. What do you mean? I just was gonna, I was gonna kill myself today, and, uh, and then now I just survived this. So now I'm torn. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta see this note. Where, where, where would you put it's the note? It's under a lot quick? of rubble. It'd yeah, be over there, probably. These walls are not sturdy at all. And nobody told us it was a death trap when we moved in. Yeah. I mean, the guy moved that we, uh, the guy died before us. Yeah, I know. But still. But not from the walls. No. It's that, I remember an alert reaction or something like that. The real estate know. agents are supposed to inform you of, like, this is, we should have had this checked. We should have had this checked. Dave, why were you going to commit suicide? I don't know. I swear I heard the walls talking, and I know that's not real, so. <laughs> I just thought I was going crazy, and I couldn't kick it, and I was like, well, if I'm crazy, I'm just going to end it, and that'll be it. That makes no sense to me. I know, it's weird, but it's like, now I don't hear anything. <laughs> I mean, right before it all went down, I heard people like screaming like, ah! And I was like, they're yeah. not real, they're in my head. And then everything toppled and now here I am. Well, you heard me scream. That, well, yeah, but I heard like five voices screaming. That's not a, but killing yourself. I know, what I know. What about me? I, sh I wrote you a note. <laughs> I didn't write a note to my mom. I didn't write a note to my third grade English teacher. I wrote a note to you. Why would you have written a note to your third grade English teacher? I'm just th saying I didn't write a note to people and you're not one of those. I wrote a note to you. Dear Dave, if you're reading this note, it means I'm dead. Obviously, that's inaccurate. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, but if the earthquake hadn't happened, I don't know that it was an sense. earthquake. No other house. Look, everything else is fine. It's just this house. Weird. If I hadn't been standing in this door, I'm so thankful for this doorway. Yeah, this door is great. <laughs> <laughs> this door saved our lives. This is the greatest. Ah, if my doorways could talk, I'd be like, "Good job, buddy." <laughs> <laughs> That's all I wanted to hear. Oh, God. Are you hearing something? I swear I'm hearing something. No, but I'm reading. All right, I'm sorry. Oh, sorry. Sorry to interrupt my suicide note with my being alive. <laughs> I want to understand. I, I mean, you write, I'm leaving you, and I know you'll be sad, and I'm okay with it. <laughs> yeah, I didn't think I'd have to hear you read it. Please tell my mom I love her. Please tell Mrs. Johnson she taught me third grade. <laughs> I didn't write the note to them. I wrote it to you. I just, I, I gave you an assignment. Yeah. <laughs> but just two, I didn't ask you to do it. You well. don't even, you, you told, you drew a picture of the school and the location in your town. I'm supposed to go find her? Well, I didn't want you to have to go to Google Maps. <laughs> I don't understand. Why would you not talk to me before killing yourself? How would this sound? The walls are talking, I'm crazy, and want to end things. No, they're not. You're fine. Let's have dinner. OK, well, it sounds silly now. OK. <laughs> Listen, promise me next time you're going to kill yourself. Talk to me first. I mean, maybe I'll go with you. <laughs> OK. I, mean, I, don't want, I don't want you killing yourself. Well, can I have my suicide note back? No. What are you going to do with it? I well, I guess framing it to be weird. Um, <laughs> you want to frame it? I don't know. I mean, uh, the fact that I'm alive, maybe I should frame it and say... How about writing in a live note? All right. That's yeah. a good idea. So we get a new place to live. Well, yeah, we don't have any paper left. No. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. Everybody's dead. Not me. <laughs> <laughs>
thing. You're not important. <laughs> You're just empty space. Hey, you know what? I saved someone's life today. Huh? What did you do? You finally got your wish. Jerry's all on top of you. Yeah. <laughs> How does it feel? Not so great, huh? No. Uh, it was good for me, Susan. <laughs> <laughs> It's kind of all that matters for me. So incredibly selfish. Uh, hey, guys, we're all on top of Susan right now. Like, and literally I... every one of us is on Susan. It's like a gangbang for walls. <laughs> I'm not sharing Susan with any of you. I've got this end of Susan over here. I'm, I'm nowhere near you. Your rubble better not be touching mine. <laughs> or else what? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> guys, guys, it's me, Herbert. I, I fell forward. I'm so alone out here. Should have thought of that before you lost your friends, Herbert. <laughs> guys, you're the only friends I had. You're the only friends I had. You make fun of us for years. Guys. No. Guys. What? I'm sorry. What? I'm sorry. About what specifically? I want in on the... Susan action. <laughs> what? You... Everyone else is having a good time, and, and I'm out here on the grass. As far as I'm concerned, I'm the only one here. Well, you're really not, bro. We're all here, OK? We're all here. Guys, I have to be honest. I've been in love with Jerry for a long time. Well, how could you not be? You're staring at him I constantly. Know. I just got used to him. Haven't you heard of the science experiment where if you stare at someone in the eyes uninterrupted for 60 seconds, you might fall in love with them? Yeah, well, you guys were looking at me the whole time. Nobody fell in love with me. Because you're an asshole, Herbert! <laughs> <laughs> promise me, if you ever decide to kill yourself again, because I can't live without you, Wow, wow, I didn't know you felt that way. Ha, huh. what? We, we met on Craigslist. I, I know. Just, <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't know that you could find love by chance. How do you think people find love? I don't know. It's almost always by chance. It's never planned. Listen, if you don't feel the same way, I mean, there's still plenty of ways to off yourself. <laughs> Are you saying my choice is to actually kill myself or be in love with you? Like I'm you or me? I'm just saying. I don't know. Hey if I guys, can... just out of curiosity, they like seem like they're going through some real shit and we're squabbling about being walls. Like maybe we should pay attention. It's not being a wall I'm squabbling about, it's the fact that you guys have forsaken me. I was the leader amongst you. You were not the I leader. I was the leader. Just because you face the sun doesn't mean shit. The sun chose me. Do you know who chose you? Who? An architect you never met. You take that back. You are an architect's you master. You take that back. <laughs> I do love you, because I just was afraid to tell you. I could have written it. I don't see an I love you on here. It's an invisible I... ink. I thought if one day you ever put it under a black light, you'd go, shit. <laughs> <laughs> a black light? What exactly did you use to write it? <laughs> What did you use to write that would show up in a black light? I watched 10 seasons of CSI. What did you use? Semen. <laughs> you hear that, guys? <laughs> Doorway. You're empty space. Do you realize that? You're negative space. 
Maybe I'm the only one here who feels full, even though I'm technically empty. <laughs> I didn't really, I was just, when you said CSI, I was just like, what if I say semen, what do we do? So what did you use? Oh, I just used a black ink marker. Okay. Like, it was just a regular. <laughs> get them at the mall. They're just like, this shows up on our black list. Not a big deal. <laughs> Listen. Without you, I'm nothing, okay? I'm not going to stop you if you want to kill yourself because I care about you too much. I know that's counter <laughs> counterintuitive. You know what? Maybe I needed these walls to come down because they were the walls blocking my heart. I was blocking the sun! It was my job and I did it damn well! <laughs> I was blocking you from falling down into the earth. I did my job well. I'm on top of Susan. <laughs>